Hey everyone, this is Tim from Your Six Studios. Today in this video, I'm gonna go ahead and show you how to pair your PlayStation 5 controller and connect it to your PC using the Bluetooth pairing. So let's go ahead and jump in the video right now. So did you know that you can wirelessly connect your PlayStation 5 controller over to your PC if you have Bluetooth available on it? Now I have a Windows 10 computer and I'm gonna go ahead and show you how to connect your controller. So let's switch over to my desktop right now. Then in the bottom left, let's go to type here to search and type in Bluetooth. And then select it at the top and open up the Bluetooth and other devices page. Then at the top where it says add Bluetooth or other device, let's select that. Then go to the top where it says Bluetooth, mice, keyboards, pens, etc. Let's select that. Now it says add a device. Now place your DualSense controller into Bluetooth pairing mode by pressing and holding down the share button and the PlayStation button at the same time. So let's go ahead and do that. Then the light bar around the touchpad will blink in about six seconds. So it should start blinking. And our PlayStation 5 controller is now in Bluetooth pairing mode. You can see it blinking. Now let's go back over to my Windows 10 PC. And I can see it just showed up under add a device. Let's select wireless controller and it's connecting to my PS5 controller now. All right, so Windows 10 is setting up my device and my wireless controller now is connected to Steam. So my device is ready to go. Now let's go over to Steam to make sure this works. All right, so I'm in Steam right now. I'm gonna use the D-pad to move around. As you can see, this is indeed working. Now the touchpad doesn't work yet, I can't move around with the cursor on it, but my thumbsticks work, my right and left bumper work. Now I haven't tried this out in any specific game, so if you are using this, go ahead and make a comment down below and just tell everyone what games work and what games don't. Now I'm gonna go ahead and play around with this with DS4 for Windows and see if I can get it to work in games that don't support like the PlayStation 4 controller games that are off Steam, etc. And just see if it overall works more efficiently. Now, if I go to the top to settings and then go to controller settings, I have my PlayStation configuration support. And as you can see, it detects it as a PlayStation 5 controller. So this is really, really cool that they added Bluetooth support for the PlayStation 5 controller. We don't have to buy the adapter that costs like 50 or 60 bucks like we did with the PlayStation 4 controller. And most computers come with Bluetooth nowadays. So if this video did indeed help you guys out, go ahead and leave it a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel down below for more PlayStation 5 tech help tips coming up next on Your Six Studios.